Hey again. We are going to have some fine weather for many places as we go through the end of this week and through much of this weekend. But before that, we do have a front across the UK and this is bringing quite a bit of cloud and a bit of rain across much of England and Wales as we go through the rest of this evening and overnight. That front is shifting its way towards the southeast though, so clearer skies following in behind. But do watch out, there could be some heavier bursts of rain across parts of the southeast through the early hours of Friday morning. Behind it, like I said, some clearer skies and a few showers for western parts of Scotland but under the clearer skies it is going to turn a little bit fresher for some of us than it has done recently away from the towns and cities temperatures dropping into mid single figures markedly milder than this warmer than this towards the southeast where we have that cloud that front lingering so it is going to be a bit of a gray and uh, at times damp start across the far southeast first thing tomorrow but that front quickly clearing away towards the southeast and then for much of England and Wales a lot of fine sunny weather around, perhaps a little bit more cloud towards the north. Across Northern Ireland, a bit more cloud here, some bright sunny spells and similar across Scotland, but here we will also have quite a few showers, especially towards the northwest. Some of the showers could be a little bit on the punchy side and there will be some blustery winds here and those blustery winds will add to the relatively cool feel to things. Temperatures in the north for some struggling to just the mid-teens Celsius, significantly warmer than this further south. Towards the southeast we're looking at highs of around 24-25 Celsius, so not as warm as it has been, but nonetheless, with lighter winds here and a decent amount of sunshine, it will feel warm. Through the end of the day, we are going to have more showers across parts of Scotland, and overnight, we could see a few showers across parts of Northern Ireland, maybe a few for Northern England and Western Wales, but on the whole, across much of England and Wales, it is going to stay dry with some clear skies around. And so again, where we see the skies clear, temperatures are going to take a bit of a dip, and so once more rural spots dropping into mid-single figures in some places, most built-up areas just about holding up in double digits through Saturday itself and like I said the weekend's actually looking largely fine. Yes there will be some showers coming in from the west on that westerly flow and so they're most likely in western areas. In fact towards the east you'd be pretty unlucky to catch a shower and on the whole there looks like there'll be a lot of dry and particularly around parts of East Anglia, South East England. Lots of sunny weather here. Elsewhere a bit more cloud building and spreading out as we go through the day but there should still be some bright sunny spells and for most of the wind's not particularly strong though still quite blustery towards the north of the UK. Temperatures look relatively similar to Friday really for some maybe a degree or so down but still in the sunshine feeling warm enough. As we go into Sunday, and there will still be some more showers across northern parts of the UK on Sunday with some blustery winds. Notice the tightly packed isobars here. Elsewhere, largely fine as we go into the start of Monday before a system comes in from the southwest. And so most of us are going to see some fairly wet weather for a time as we go into the beginning of next week. For more information about what we can expect, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and then you'll never miss an update. I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.